हेलो एवरी वन माई नेम इज मिनी सेठी आई होप यू ऑल आर स्टे हेल्थी टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट शॉर्ट रन एंड लॉन्ग रन इक्वली बी रेम अंडर परफेक्ट कॉम्पिटिशन मार्केट सो वॉट इज परफेक्ट कॉम्पिटिशन परफेक्ट कॉम्पिटिशन इज अ मार्केट सिचुएशन इन विच सो मेनी बायर्स एंड सेलर्स आर कंसिस्ट एंड दे आर बाइंग एंड सेलिंग होमोजीनियस प्रोडक्ट परफेक्ट कॉम्पिटिशन इज अ मार्केट सिचुएशन इन विच सो मेनी बायर्स एंड सेलर्स आर कंसिस्ट एंड दे आर बाइंग एंड सेलिंग होमोजीनियस प्रोडक्ट homogeneous product means exactly same kind of product for example in case of agriculture market there are so many farmers who are producing and selling exactly same kind of crops like wheat and mango and there are so many person who are buying these kind of crops so it will call perfect competition market so firstly we are going to talk about short run equilibrium under perfect competition market in short time period under perfect competition form basically face three kind of equilibrium super normal profit normal profit and loss one by one we discuss about each so firstly we are going to talk about super normal profit one most important thing you must keep in your mind in order to get equally be rem under perfect competition market two conditions must be satisfied and these two condition will remain same in all equilibriums first condition is mc equal to mr mc is our marginal cost cost of producing one additional unit and mr is our marginal revenue income that we get by sale of one additional unit first condition is mc must be equal to mr second condition is mc cut mr from below means marginal cost curve cut mr the revenue curve from below in this diagram you can see on x axis we have output on y axis we have cost and revenue and this horizontal line represent marginal revenue and average revenue this curve represent marginal cost at this t point marginal cost curve is equal to marginal revenue at this e point marginal cost curve also equal to marginal revenue but this ep is not stable equilibrium point e is stable equilibrium point why why t is not stable equilibrium point because at t point my mc become equal to mr by cutting from above you can see here but at this e point mc become equal to mr by cutting from below and this e is more stable equilibrium point because here two condition are satisfied mc is equal to mr plus mc mc cut mr from below now we are going to talk about super normal profit what is super normal profit super normal profit is excess profit of firm when firm total revenue is more than from total cost firm get super normal profit or we can say that when firm income is more than from cost firm get super normal profit now we will see super normal profit with the help of this diagram in this diagram on x axis we have output and y axis we have price cost and revenue this horizontal line represent our marginal revenue and average revenue mr is marginal revenue and ar is average revenue and this red curve represent our marginal cost mc is our marginal cost and this black curve represent our average cost ac is our average cost so uh, as we earlier discussed in order to get equally be rem under perfect competition market two conditions must be satisfied these two conditions are mc is equal to mr and mc cut mr from below at this t point you can see mc is equal to mr plus mc is cutting mr from below so t is our stable equilibrium point and our equilibrium output is oq and equilibrium price op so now where is super normal profit we can calculate super normal profit when we minus total cost from total revenue we can calculate super normal profit when we minus total cost from total revenue and here our total cost is o r k q our total cost is o r k q and our total revenue is o p t q when we minus o r k q from o p t q it will be equal to r p t k and this r p t k is our super normal profit or we can say that when we remove o r k q part from o p T Q part, then we will get R P T K, and this R P T K is our super normal profit. This part is called our super normal profit.
Now we are going to talk about normal profit. In case of normal profit, firm takes enough revenue to cover its expenses. In case of normal profit, firm takes enough revenue to cover its expenses. Or we can say that in case of normal profit, total cost is equal to total revenue. If total cost is equal to total revenue, then where is profit? Actually, normal profit include in total cost. Normal profit are part of total cost. In case of normal profit, firm mainly recover its factor. Cost, for example, cost of waste, cost of rent, cost of interest. That's why normal profit include in total cost. Normal profit are part of total cost. So, in case of normal profit, total revenue or equal to total cost. Now we will see where is normal profit with the help of this diagram. In this diagram on x-axis we have output and y-axis we have price, cost, and revenue. This horizontal line represent our margin revenue, the average revenue curve. This red curve represent our margin cost and this black curve represent our average cost at this t point mc is equal to mr mc cut mr from below that's why t is stable equilibrium point now we will see where is normal profit as we earlier discussed in case of normal profit total cost is equal to total revenue so here total cost is optq and total revenue is also optq at this t point total cost is equal to total revenue so we can say that t is normal profit point now we are going to talk about loss as we know in case of loss cost is more than from our income so we can say that in case of loss total cost is more than from total revenue now we will see where firm is getting loss with the help of this diagram in this diagram on x-axis we have output and y-axis we have price revenue and cost this horizontal line represent our margin revenue and average revenue this red curve represent our marginal cost this black curve represent our average cost at this E point MC is equal to MR and MC cut MR from below that's why E is our equilibrium point. Now we will see where our firm is getting loss. So we can calculate loss when we minus total revenue from total cost. We can calculate loss when we minus total revenue from total cost. So here our total revenue is OPEQ. Our total revenue is OPEQ and our total cost is ORK. Q. When we minus O P E Q from O R K Q, it will be equal to P R K E and P R K E is our loss. P R K E is our loss going to talk about long run equilibrium under perfect competition market at long time period under perfect competition market all firm will get normal profit at long time period under perfect competition market all firm will get normal profit why all firm will get normal profit uh, suppose during short time period all firm are getting super normal profit to see their super normal profit more firm will enter in the market as more firm will enter in the market supply increase their profit will divide as a result, all firm will come to normal profit. On the other hand, if short time period, all firm are getting loss. Because of loss, some firm will exit from the market, means some firm will leave the market. As some firm exit from the market, supply will fall, their profit will increase. As a result, all firm will come to normal profit. So, we can say that at long time period, under perfect competition market, all firm will get normal profit. Now, we will see diagram of normal profit at long time period, under perfect competition market. In this diagram on x-axis we have output and y-axis we have cost revenue and price this horizontal line represent our margin revenue and average revenue because we are talking about long time period that's why this red one lmc curve represent long run marginal cost and this black curve lac represent long run average cost e is our equilibrium point at this point mc is equal to mr plus mc cut mr from below now where is normal profit as we know in case of normal profit total cost is equal to total revenue. Here our total cost is OPEQ and our total revenue is also OPEQ. So at this E point our total revenue is equal to total cost. So we can say the A is normal profit point. So this is all about short run and long run equilibrium under perfect competition market. I think you got it and thank you so much for watching this video. Bye. Take care.